So hello, uh, very, very warm greetings to 7th World Film Festival in Hyderabad in India. Um, I'm really very, very happy and uh, gladful to be part of this wonderful uh, festival. So my first uh, intro is to tell you a bit of the story behind of my film. So this film is based on a remarkable dream I had uh, shortly after my father died. This is now nine years ago. And the dream was like this. Uh, I was on a seaside seabed and in universe at the same time. Infinity all around. And there was a heavy Renaissance gate. Uh, which was closed, only the gate. And next to this Renaissance gate stood Erasmus of Rotterdam. And he opened the door a tiny little crack and said to me, just look outside. Um, then he closed the door. And then he said to me, find the key. So I was completely confused. And... Um, at the times uh, I was working in the EU, EU, EU uh, research project in Antwerp and Brussels. And there I went to Ghent uh, to see this famous um, Ghent altarpiece of the brothers Jan and Hubertus van Eyck. Uh, this is a masterpiece in which the spiritual world, the invisible thing behind things, is depicted for the first time in a perfect three-dimensional form and on this altar stands the lamp Christ uh, in the middle of this piece with a clear knowing gaze uh, this lamp who stands here so innocently uh, where its heart sits uh, flows the heart blood out and uh, this is this magical life blood which uh, Every thought, every meaning, every doing in our life should be uh, based on this, what we are doing with our heart. And I stood immersed in the sweet eternal moment of devotion um, in front of this and maybe for hours. And suddenly in this silence came the answer and the answer is love is the key. So, to my roadblocks, uh, what uh, was going on then? So it took me nine years to finish the film. In these years, I went through hell. Uh, lots of pain and, and private sufferings. Had two times a near-death uh, experience. And many, many times I wanted to quit this film. But there was always a voice from heaven which said to me, to my heart, to my soul, um, no, you have to finish this film. You have to bring this message of love to people for peace, for salvation, for all sorts of pain and grief, for hope that love will heal everything. The pyramid, which you see behind, um, is for me a symbol for femininity for Mother Earth, for all feminine power, which should be lived, which is good for men and women, because it means strength. The rose uh, stands for love and the crystal for the spirit. This being shot down has double meanings for me, physically and mentally being hurt, as we all have experienced these things in our lives to go through this pain and come out strong as before is my message for all people we all get salvation through god and no matter what religion we have it does not depend on it because god is love and in god's heart we all are one we all are one spirit one one big family, so we all are connected. So I want to say something to the human and financial challenges. 
uh, when it comes about the human resources, I'm a lucky one because I had so much support of my friends, especially thanks to Romana Plana. She's the mastermind behind the pyramid and producer of it. The actors and location manager are all friends who helped me to realize the film. The film editing and cutting did the genius regisseur Wolfgang Scherz who transformed the film exactly in pictures so extremely similar to my dream pictures. The film is completely financed by my own. Uh, the shooting was a bit challenging because it was very cold and foggy November day in a forest. The actress Anna was a very strong to stand this. I took all my little money to bring this message of love out. I always had a very strong vision of the dream and this was through all the years my guidance. Uh, the, the film has 11 minutes 28 seconds and shows the walk through my dream over being hurted to hope to salvation. Uh, these 11 minutes are short but same time a small eternity and you should have patience to see the film till the end of all credits because there is a little lovely surprise a message from a kid um, target audience usp and message to emerging filmmakers um, so the target audience is all human beings all should hear and feel the essence of life which is living in love uh, living in peace, which needs the world right in this moment of time so much. Um, since the film is an input from the spiritual world, I'm channel here, and it is not about my ego or my getting famous, uh, what I want to say is always follow your dreams, follow your heart, follow your visions, no matter what the others say. Uh, in the end, you will spread strong energy and powerful good things for a higher order. We all leave our bodies behind. Uh, the development of the soul means everything. To bring out the best of you, to bring out the best in others, to help and love each other. So... Um, now there is still remaining my wishes to the 7th Indian World Film Festival and I wish you all success and that you stay as a wonderful platform to bring light and the good into this dark world. So finally I show you the laurel and you can reach me, this is the film poster and you can reach me under www.m0.at and my email address is michaela at m0.at stands for austria so if i have no special distribution plans uh, what i did is um, submit my film to many film festivals that the message of love can be spread all over and when you are interested in my film to show it somewhere so i'm very glad because uh i want this is a really deep wish deep deep in my heart that this world will turn to a better to Remember that we all are so much connected in God's love, in God's heart. We all have just one God and this is love. Thank you so much. I'm so, so thankful for being part in this lovely film festival.